Damn, in comparison to Don, the so-called vice president of Cotter Affairs, I killed that presentation. Maybe now I can move up from my crappy 9 to 5 job as a receptionist. Mr. Glover put in 500 here. Did you hear about what happened to Uh, excuse me, come in please. Um, I assume that your attempt to low-key gossip about me is about my mom's presentation. I blew the roof off Mr. Duncan's office. Okay, congratulations, Vice President. Congratulations, Mr. CEO. Hey, don't walk my goals like that. I worked really hard to impress him. <laughs> you think we're joking, buddy? <laughs> Why would we waste our time here? We know more about your future than you do, so congrats. Wait, what? Congratulations. What do you mean? Where are you guys going? Go leave. Okay. I mean, all those things I said were okay, but like not that great. I guess like I could become CEO, right? Super and tie, red Lamborghinis. No worries. Always at the top of the ladder. That just can't be a dream, right? I can always achieve it. said great news i just got called into mr duncan's office and he just upped my position in Cotter foreign affairs to vice president oh my god smiley face smiley face smiley face that's it vice president and not ceo what the what is he thinking that's when you know you've been you went wrong he could do so much better i could do so much better with that kind of salary, I'll never get my Cartier watches. Three maids aren't enough to clean my shoe collection. Only way is if we frame Dawn. But he's so soft. McBee is so soft. He's such a wuss. He'll do anything for me though. I'll make him do it. I'll, I'll motivate him to do it. Even if it means I have to get my hands dirty. I'm sure he worked very hard. You should have seen the last, guy, the last vice president of foreign affairs of Cotter. Why? Why? For years, I thought he was working to better my company, but really, he wasn't. You should have seen him. <laughs> Little did I know he was stealing money from my bank account that I had granted him full access to. Can you believe that? Wow. What a prick. I trusted him like a brother, and he turned out to be a disloyal prick. You can't trust anyone these days. He oh! He turns back on me and corrupt me. Can you believe that? No. Well, he now he's making good friends behind bars. He was the flower <laughs> with the serpent beneath it. You can put your trust in me, sir. I worked 110% to be here. I never thought I'd actually do it, but I am here. 
I need you to help me carry out dessert. We have sour keys and jolly ranchers on the menu. Um, yeah, we'll be back. Let's go. Uh, where's the jolly ranchers? Are you f***ing Wait, what? Uh, stop acting all innocent, because we all know deep down, you want to kick Don's butt. Vice President is decent, but CEO, imagine being CEO. Okay, calm down. What were you thinking? You think you're so rational? Well, you're not doing that at all. You're being the exact friggin' opposite. You know what? I can't, I can't do this. Can't believe you're throwing all these chances away that you that God is giving to you. This, this this doesn't come every day. You have a chance at being the greatest. Aren't you tired of always being second to greatest? So sorry, honey. I've I've been I, my father raised me like I was nothing. We have a chance. I we have a chance to have a full life. Vice president is decent. But imagine being CEO. How could you do this? You have a chance. Are you really doing this to me today? Okay. I pick that up. Pick them up. Okay. Okay. We're not doing this. Explain your life to me. Redefine your life. What do you see in your future? Okay, hold on. Before we do all this, okay. I think you're the one that's okay. being crazy here. Okay. Um, do you know how hard it would be to overthrow Don, our CEO? Are you thinking, like, is nothing going on there? You're clearly not intelligent. You just proved my point. You're clearly pulling words out of all the wrong places. You have a chance. You need to believe in me. You need to trust in me that I have a plan for us. Didn't remember that remember that password Don gave to you to all the accounts? Remember yeah. that? Yeah. You clearly didn't think that through. You clearly can't think straight to plan out your future. How far in the future do you think? Do you not see us in it? Do you not see us living our luxurious life together? Yeah, uh, I think we're doing good. Listen. Okay. Listen. That password that Don gave you to the account, you take it, I distract Don. You, you you tell her you forgot your wallet. Okay. That and it's in the cabinet in her office. Okay. She'll give you the keys. She she clearly trusts you. Yeah. Take it. You go in there. Okay. You transfer all the money in the safe to Don's account. It shows that Don is stealing money. Okay. Do you not see my point? Sorry. They're gonna be taken. Don is going to be taken by the police and you're next in line for CEO. Wow, I really didn't think of that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, yes, it only means second to best. Yeah. But it still worries me. What if we get caught? I'll be the one making friends behind bars. We won't. You need to trust us. If we go down, we go down together. But we're not going down because our plan will work. Okay? okay? Cover your stacks. We'll be the best. We're going to be the best. Okay. And go up there. Just just be normal. Be normal, okay? We can do this. Okay. We were born to do this. Okay. Well, I dream for high position. There's high places that I see you going and I see you achieving great things. I know you can achieve them. Okay. And just remember, you aren't a coward. Let's go. Okay, let's go. We can I believe in it. Smile. Oh, I was bored there for a while. Did you guys get what you needed? Yeah, we got everything. I hope you enjoyed these jolly matches that I picked up from the dollar store. Thank you. So fun. Um, I seem to have What's wrong not my, I don't have my wallet on me. Where did you leave? Do you remember where you left it? Uh, I think I left it at work. I'm going to go really quickly and check. You want to? Is that okay? Yeah, so sure. I'm no so no, sorry. It's, all right. it's, it's all right. like really important. I'll okay. not leave my wallet. Right. I trust you. Okay. You can go. I'll keep you company. Okay. Bye. Be back soon, okay? Fair enough. Okay. Be careful. Bye. Bye. Bye.
Uh, make sure, make sure you don't sorry. cause any trouble. Don't worry. I Did you do the deed? Yes, I did. Did it. you cover up all the evidence? Yes, I did. You do realize this man just promoted me from sitting at a desk to being his business partner. Uh, and I just framed him for such a nasty crime. You know what? This guilt is consuming me and I guess I will not be sleeping tonight. Just when I thought you finally manned up, you go ahead and do the exact same thing I expected you to do. If anything, he's the one who should feel guilty, not you. You've been a receptionist for the past 15 years. You've been loyal to his company. He hasn't been loyal to you. Everyone is supposed to be equal, okay? He's the one who walked past you every day, saw you working your butt off to get to the top of the chain, but never promoted you. Finally, when someone was being disloyal, when someone finally did the exact same thing to him as he was doing to you, he realized what, you, what position you deserved. You don't even deserve to be vice president, you deserve to be CEO. So man up and take what you deserve. Take pride in it. Let's go. I have to say one more time, I'm so glad I chose you to be vice president. Oh. I can't believe how happy I am with this decision. We're gonna make the best team. What? Hi officer, Hi. what's wrong? It has been reported somebody stole money out from the government saving. What? Miss Tan, you are on arrest for fraud. I didn't do anything. This is some kind of joke. You have right to remain silent. You have right to have an attorney and you cannot afford one. Will be provided for you. Help me, McVeigh. I didn't do anything. What? Is this some kind of joke? No. Aren't you going to do anything? I, I don't know. 